Hey there, strangers, my name's Leos, and welcome back! Once again to Long Gone Days! Last time, we wandered around uh, apparently a Russian town of Leningrad, I believe is what it was called, I'm surprised I remember that. And we couldn't understand anybody until we ran into Lynn and Ivan! Your name's Ivan, right? Let's check our menu. Lynn and Ivan, hey, I got it right, so we have two new party members. We have a full party, which is awesome, apparently Ivan can speak English and uh, Russian. So he can translate for us, so we can go talk to people. Also, while we were here, uh, there was a br brass glaking. There was glass breaking outside, so something's going on. Let's go check it out. Also, we can now talk to people. Hey, I know what I can say to him. Oh, I mean, maybe you can make Ivan do it. Hello? Oh, we've never actually been here. This is a new area. Oh, random house. Hello, my name is Link. I'm here to break all of your pots. I mean, <laughs> just gonna steal your stuff. Hello. Okay, so it said that the little, uh... The flag next to what they're saying shows what language it's being translated from. Me being me and being really bad at that sort of stuff and saying the last episode, I'm not entirely sure if we're Poland is. Um, I don't know what that flag is. I'm assuming it's either Polish. No, they're, they're the ones attacking. I don't think it's a Russian flag. I don't know. Hey, look, there's a flag. That's what it's from. Good going, all of you, uh, you geography geeks out there. <laughs> anyway, um, Lynn Nik Nikolaevich. Good to see you. That's, that's uh, someone's name. Anyway, so Ivan's neighbor is this guy's name. He's got a very, uh, very strange name. So how are you holding up with everything going on? Lynn says, hi, but but she's speaking English, but he wasn't speaking English. But I don't, <laughs> he, he speaks, apparently that guy knows English, but he doesn't want to speak it. So, well, we're doing as well as we can with this kind of situation, Ivan says. But I'd, uh, I'd say we're, we are as good as anybody right now. That's more or less what she said. Yeah, same here. I agree. What a- hey, and who are your friends? I don't think I've seen them around. We just- we just swam in earlier. I mean, we've been here for weeks. Um, oh, we- we met at the port. They're- they both missed the ferry. They're also very suspicious, but don't worry about it. I gave them some- some beer. They'll loosen up later and spill all their secrets. So they're tourists, uh, so we've been, uh, helping them get around town in the meanwhile. <coughs> I like that they believe that we're just tourists. Yep, vacation! We're tourists! Yes, exactly! Um, wow, talk about bad timing. I know, right? I mean, nice to meet you guys! I'm Gleb! Is that a real name? I feel really bad. I want to make fun of that name. But if that's a real name, I don't want to. Is Gleb a name? I don't know. Also, I just realized all the, the portraits up there, little scan lines are out of sync. The first two are together, and the second two are together. It's super weird. Anyway, nice to meet you too, sir. I don't speak English, you weirdo. Thanks for having us. He doesn't speak English, you weirdos. No need to be so formal, but here... I, okay, I don't understand. Uh, no need to be so formal. I'm not much older than you. Ha 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 ha! Not sure why I laughed at that. All right, cool. So uh, I'm, I'm trapped in this pile of people. I can't leave yet. Hey, Nikolai! Nikolai! Hey, Nico! I don't know how to say that name. Um, hey, cousin! That Nico. We'll go with that one. <laughs> it's the only Nico I know is from GTA 4. Anyway, before I forget, could you uh, help me with a bit of... Uh, help me a bit with something. What kind of something? Eh, sure, what do you need? He seems like a very off-handed kind of just, eh, sure, whatever kind of guy. Uh, well, with everything that's going on, I wanted to have my whole family under one roof to make sure we're all fine. Or we're all one big target, so if we explode, uh, no survivors will be left to carry on our legacy. But at least nobody will be sad. Uh, but my mother, you know her, she went shopping. At a time like this, she is very irresponsible, and also you said all the stores were closed. What the crap? So, ah, uh, why am I not surprised? Because you apparently know them, and she's a crazy weirdo. So right now, I'm taking care of the children, and my, my wife went to see how her family is doing. Cool. Could you go find my mother and tell her to come here? But not my wife! She goes and dies with the rest of the family. I guess that's fine. That She doesn't count. Sure, no problem. Sorry, we don't have time right now. Sure, no problem. We'll tell her to go home. Why would she care if we told her when she didn't care when you told her earlier before she left? It's weird. So, oh, thank you. I knew you'd say yes. Because, you know, you like quests and stuff. Um, uh, she should be at the fruit stand near the town square. I know where that is because I stole fruit from there. Uh, please find her and tell her to come home. I mean, I have no idea what you're talking about, officer. <laughs> Don't worry. We will. Thank you. See you around. Cool. Sorry, quest. Where is she? Where are the bobs? Where are they? We're Batman now. Don't worry about it. Uh, she went to the fruit stand near the town square. Please find her and tell her to come home. Cool. Oh, can somebody actually read this now? What is this? Oh, nope. Not, not gonna let me steal that. Hello. I'm gonna go through your, uh, your stuff. I stole. She went to the store to buy food so we don't starve. I'm gonna steal your bread, bye! I am, I'm, I'm Link. 
I'm just, I'm linking around over here. Hello, there's nothing in here. Yes, totally, because they've got no more food. We ate it all. Sorry, children, you're gonna starve now. Sir, are you an American? That's the child's voice. Um, how would, how could we understand him? And also, are, am also, are we American? I actually don't know. We were in an underground facility right next to Poland or Russia or wherever we are. Uh, mister, why can't you speak Russian like us? I don't know, because I, one, that's stupid, and how would I understand you, stupid child? Like she's a small child, she would know, but you're stupid! I want to judge you, as an adult. <laughs> There's nothing here. The adult that's playing a video game and yelling at a fictional character. That's the kind of adult I am. I can't read what it says. We have someone here who can sit down and read all this stuff in this guy's house. Actually, oh, no, I was going to see if that stuff was anything. Go back in there. Is there anything in your, uh, your, your duffel bag over here? Uh, hello, duffel bag. Is still more stuff? No? Cool. We should leave this stuff alone. Alright, cool. I guess, if we have to. Alright, so, um, wasted some time in there. <laughs> hello, I'm gonna yell in your window. Stupid child! Oh, hello! Hi! She has stopped me with her, uh, force field. Concerned woman says, Bar con tell crab. Yep, that's what she said. S sorry, I can't understand what you're saying. Luckily, this guy can. I guess here's where we're supposed to have learned about it. All right, I'll translate for you guys. Thank you, quite. How was I talking to the people inside? Are you okay? I guess what they said. The neighbors, they are all out of their minds. I tried to stop them, but they are trashing the store. The stores, they're next door to the store. You were afraid of her walking two buildings over. Also, the store is attached to a house. It's super weird. Anyway, they're trashing the store, trying to steal as much as they can. Well, I guess if the town's gonna be wrecked. Uh, someone called the police yet? Uh, I guess not. It's no use! They're I keep doing the Silver the Hedgehog thing. Don't worry about it. <laughs> uh, it's no use. They're busy with the whole evacuation. Um, some neighbors are even playing uh, <coughs> plenty of way to defend the city by themselves. It's insane! That crazy old veteran is recruiting people to join him in on his ridiculous plan. On his ridiculous plan. Uh, he's at the town square, so I recommend you avoid him at all costs, unless you want a cool side quest where you beat up a bunch of dudes. Which I think we will. Uh, I think you should go home and wait for the ferry there. It could be dangerous for you to stay here right now. Okie doke. Yeah, I think I'll do that. Be careful. Okay, goodbye. Go go back by the store that's being looted right now that's super dangerous. Don't worry about it. Goodbye. All right, maybe we should check on that old guy. Sure, why not? All right, so uh, hi, lady. I shouldn't bother her. Same lady. She's moved and started crying somewhere else. Just spreading her crying around. So, uh, frustrated looking man. Oh, I didn't say what that, wow, I didn't see what that lady's name was. Uh, I'm gonna rewind the episode and find out. <laughs> um, I can't believe they're doing this. They should stop trying to help not cause more destruction. Or they should be trying to help not cause more destruction. Cool. I agree. What do you say, pessimistic woman? So pessimistic with her orange hair. That's pink, not orange. Shut up. Um, reddish, reddish, pink is short. Oh, whatever. Uh, this place is done for. Enjoy a little time we have left until they come and kill us all. Why would, why would they be? Why would they just come kill us? What's the point? Annoyed, man. Cops ain't doing crap. Because I'm... I don't know what I should say that. Uh, <laughs> go in and grab whatever you want. They say, uh, yep, grab whatever you want. Can I beat him up and save the day? No, I shouldn't take advantage of the situation. You're running for your lives. And, like, you're being hunted down. There, people are going to try to kill you. I think it's okay if you steal some bread. Not from those people's house like you did. From this establishment, which is probably going to be burned to the ground. It's a little bit more understandable. What'd she say? Her name? Oh, didn't actually see her name. All right, cool. Hey, another dog. Dog. Dog, talk to me, dog. Yo, dog. Okay, he said bark, bark. Hey, I see a loot crate. Cool. So, a friendly woman. It must be awful finding yourself in this or this situation in a foreign country. How do you know I'm foreign? Have you been following me this whole time, you creepy weirdo? Hello. There you Someone is recruiting people to defend the town. I would help, but it sounds scary, said the scared young man. I guess that kind of fits your name, doesn't it? Anything in there? Nothing here but trash. I mean, there's a chair and a road cone. Maybe, what if you use that road cone? That could be cool. Med kit. There was just a med kit laying in the middle. Who wraps up these things? It's a loot box crate thing. I can't read any of the stuff on the wall, can I? Oh, I can't get to it. Oh, we'll look at that other boy band thing. All right, whatever. Let's see if we can go into this random person's house. Hello, my name is Link. I want to steal your stuff. Hey, it works. That was the secret password the whole time. Hello. Hi there. Don't mind me. I'm going to look through your stuff first. Hmm, interesting. Nothing in here. Oh, no. Oh, I found some cookies. Don't mind me. Well, no cookies. Okay, we got all this stuff. Anything? What's this? Is that a picture of your family? It's a nice photo of a woman and a child. Oh, oh is she going to be missing her child? I can't read these. Can I go into your bedroom now? Can you drop your lights now? Do you have a TV? Seems really boring in here. No TV over? Is this TV? 
can't read what the TV says. Okay, cool. Hello! Hi! Is your daughter missing? Please help me! I can't find my daughter anywhere in this room! I've been pacing back and forth for hours and I can't find her! Uh, I have searched for her everywhere. Yeah, she literally just walking back and forth, says so she's looked everywhere. Man, offer help. Sure. Uh, when did you last see her? This is Mila. Uh, oh wait, this is Mila we're talking about, right? Cool. Yes, dot dot dot. I dot dot dot. Remember, Mila was playing with the toys in our backyard. I should check the backyard, but I'm too dumb to do that. Also, it looks like that would just go back into a bedroom or something. Where's your door to the backyard? Uh, after I told her um, we would have to leave, she became really upset. So I went inside to find something to cheer her up. And then she ran away and I didn't go after her. I stood in here and started yelling for help inside of my own house. Um, but when I came back, she was gone. Cool. You're a bad mother. I'm just saying she was trying, but she'd go find her. Uh, did you notice anything else? Yes, my, my child was missing. <laughs> mm, oh, one of her toys uh, was missing. A plastic shovel. She's dug a cave, which she will live in. A shovel that might be, she might be somewhere where there's plenty of sand or soil. She's probably making a sandcastle or something. Right, leave it to us. We'll bring back your daughter, bring her back here as soon as possible. We're superheroes now. Thank you, thank you. She's wearing a blue dress. I hope that helps. Was she the girl earlier that they said was a woman? Probably not. Find the lost girl. Is this a new quest or is it just these the quests we've already seen before? Kaliningrad, got that right. Uh, yes, these are the uh, the quests that we already had access to. Anyway, it's actually really super weird. Oh, there's the TV. I just saw it on the, the wall there. Super unimportant, but I'm assuming this giant thing is their TV or an air conditioning unit. It's one of those. They I mean, they're basically just as entertaining. Uh, anyway, hello, road codes. No, okay. Hello. Hi, lady. Desperate woman. Uh, are we at war? Uh, are you? D do you have a gun? I mean, I, you're, you don't look like you're at war. Uh, she means the the country. Um, I don't know, really. I hope not, says business savvy woman. I'm so business savvy. I'll tell you all about war. Okay, so there. Okay, cool. Nothing there. Hello. It's like he has a cat. Oh, it's crazy. Oh, is she homeless or something? Uh, girl playing with cat. Hey, guys, can you give me a hand with this cat? Why don't we... <laughs> Sure. Sure, what do you need? Be nice to know what we're, we're agreeing to first. Ever since the evacuation started, everyone has been worried about being the first to go on the ferry. But no one is taking care of all the stray animals living here. I've seen a few of them. Hey, uh, I would like to save as, ma as much cats and dogs. As much cats and dogs. As many cats as dogs is what they mean to say. Also, as many cats and dogs is what they mean to say. I can't talk either. Uh, I'm doing this episode immediately after the last one, so I apologize if I'm... Uh, my, my, Everything's broken. My brain, my mouth, whatever. But I need help to find and rescue them. That's her That's her voice now. So, uh, what can we do to help? Steal every animal you find and bring them to me. I will make a cat and dog army to fight off the invading forces and make them into armor or something. I'll be Catwoman. That's actually, a, that's already an existing character. Shut up. Um, her name is Animal Advocate. I didn't notice that. If you find cats or dogs around town, would you grab them and bring them to me, please? Because... Stray animals just love it when random people grab them off the street. That's mm, that's a bad idea, especially cats. No, both. I just think cats will scratch you. Dogs will bite you. Anyway, I'll, uh, I'll make sure they get to the ferry safely. How are you gonna do that? Also, the, no, who's gonna attack the animals? See, just let them go. They'll, they'll survive, maybe, I don't know. I mean, they may not survive in a while. I'm covering all my bases while I'm saying everything. No problem, we'll do what we can. I know we're somewhere right now. Thank you very much. Bring them back here, I'll take care of them. Shut up, bye. Shut up, lady. I'm gonna go grab this dog I saw earlier. Womp, 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 womp. I just noticed his, his walk is like, his foot kind of flops out forward. He's got a very like rubbery walk. Hello, dog. Grab him. Grab my butt. Yeah. I used to have a dog just like this when I was younger. I remember I spent a whole summer trying to teach him tricks, but I couldn't even get him to sit. I was a terrible owner. Anyway, let me handle this one. He stole the dog. Cool. So we stole one dog. Um, actually, let's go turn this in. I'm wondering if she has different dialogue for each animal you give her. Or she'll just be like, hey, bring some more back, please. That would be great. Where's the dog? Well, where's the other three people that have merged inside of me? All right. Hello. How you doing? Bring them here and I'll take care of all of them. Uh, but only once you have all of them. I have a photographic memory of every single animal in this town. If you don't bring them all to me at once, I refuse to take any of them. That's the kind of person I am. A crazy weirdo. I'm also a crazy weirdo, but in a different way. All right, cool. So let's, uh, let's go look for a little girl and some animals and find a crazy guy who's recruiting people. Oh, we're over here now. Oh, okay. Explains where we were. Hello. Um, there's supposed to be a lady here. Hi, sorry to bother you. We're looking for an old lady. That's very specific. Uh, she said she wanted to purchase apples. 
but we didn't have any apples. Somebody stole all the apples. It was us in the last episode, in case you missed that. <laughs> uh, uh, she said she wanted to purchase apples. We're wondering if she uh, if she came here. Um, oh, yes. Well, she was just here. But as you can see, she's already gone. What a weird... As you can see, there is no old lady here. You should look elsewhere, human. <laughs> It's a weird thing to say. I believe she said she wanted to go to the church and leave uh, something for the people in need. That's really cool of her. I appreciate her being a, a nice Samaritan person. Oh, okay. Cool. So she went. Ju she just went in there. She may be able to still catch her. I'm assuming this is the last place she'd go, and then she go home. Thank you. We'll be going then. Good luck. Can we end this conversation? Why is everyone taking so long to say everything? All right. Anything else to say to you? Hello? Talk? Hello? Hi. I believe she went to church. Yada, yada, yada. Just went in there. Maybe we'll catch her. Cool. Good luck. Hello, officer. I didn't steal those apples. Disappointed, officer. I heard that all military units are heading towards the Polish border, but that's all I know. Okay, cool. Neato. Super swanky. Hello! Do you know of this boy band on the wall? Uh, why is the government not doing anything at all? Says angry looking civilian. Why is the government not here? Government's forced to take care of everything for me. Oh, it's a grizzled man. So, uh, hey, you look like strong, capable kids. You're now part of my militia. We didn't know. I don't think. Yes, you are. Welcome. Here's a gun. Uh, do you want to join the cause? Um, uh, yeah, let's ask. The cause? What cause? It's just a military coming to kill everybody. What are you talking about, the cause? Um, yes, that's what I just said. Are you not from here? You're not from here, are you? Person who clearly isn't speaking your language and has to have a translator. Obviously not. In any case, we need all of the help we can get. Cool. Let's just all spread out real quick. Uh, how can we help? Asks Lynn. Those Polish soldiers, they'll get here in no time. There's a huge chance uh, they'll probably be here before the ferry arrives in a few hours. Huh? Um, so we're going to fight fight them back. Cool. Also, can we find out why they're attacking? That would be useful. Uh, that's a terrible idea. All those soldiers we're speaking of, uh, we're speaking of not a mob, so they'll have guns. And that would be bad because we don't have those. You're speaking with an experienced veteran. Me, one military guy. I clearly am better than all of this entire army of military that's coming this way. I feel there's a flaw in your logic there, sir. Psst, Rourke, should we tell him where the guys who are causing the problem? Eh? Okay, we're going over here. This isn't suspicious at all. If our brothers do not find us here, if, no, if they find us here, if our brothers were to find us here, it would be all over for us. It, it's that's the same regardless. Uh, we need to leave now. Uh, I know, I know, but Rourke's a good guy and refuses to let that happen again. It can't happen again. I have to do something. I agree, Rourke. Let's save the day. We can't just stay here with our arms crossed. I mean, you could. But it probably wouldn't be the best idea. You'll have, uh, you'll just get everyone killed. Don't encourage people to join this nonsense. I, I, I agree. It's military force versus people who have no training. Like, they were trapped here in fight back. That's one thing. I guess prepare for the fight, but I don't know. All these people don't seem like the kind to be able to fight. I, I will help. Cool. No, what the crap did you just say? Where, where the hell are you doing? You know, you know who's coming. You know what they're capable. How do you know what the hell's going on here, uh, blonde guy? Shut up. Um... They're just, uh, there's just, there's just nothing we can do. Um, we can't run forever. They deserve to be punished! Um, which of these will work better for a dare? Like, on one hand, like, we, uh, I would say more they need to be stopped because of the garbage that they're doing. They're threatening lives of innocent people. Um, but like, they deserve to be punished! Like, we're, we need some crazy weirdo, the punisher just killing everybody. I'd say we can't run forever. Maybe that will fit more with his logic. So, listen, we can't run forever. We have to go on... Well, we can't go on pretending nothing happened, even though we only started doing that about an hour ago. That's not the point. We'll eventually have to face them. Unless we're really... Unless we run more than five feet. Maybe if we were another country, we'd probably be fine. Nobody even know. I know, but what are we going to do against them? We don't even have our weapons. What, weapons? Hello? It's nobody listening to this conversation here. <laughs> we'll figure it out. Let's help however we can. Mm, I mean, we're trained military people for 22 years! We should be able to figure something out, right? Uh, we'll figure it out. Let's help however we can. Alright then. Well, we need to help however we can. I agree. Uh, with or without guns. You guys said you know how to use guns? No! <laughs> I need to do this for myself for my s and for my sanity. I agree. Dot dot dot. I'll help too. Because otherwise I'll be out of- Yeah! We got buddy points! Because otherwise, like, you know, he's got no point in the story and he'll leave. He's got to do that if he wants to keep existing in this game. Count me in, too. I'm sorry, what? I don't understand English. Oh, right. Uh, that's what I like to hear. 
foreign languages that I don't understand. I just noticed that the bottom of the, the fountain is like moving because the sprite work is attached to the fountain, I guess. It looks weird. Anyway, hmm, says Ivan. Now that he was he was studying the weird wiggly fountain. Uh, now that we're, uh, we are liking most, wait, now what we are liking the most is manpower and tanks because they have a tank, I'm just saying. Uh, do you know, do you guys know what happened? Do you know what happened to handle a gun? Do you guys happen to know how to handle a gun? I can read sometimes. We um, both have military training. Well, that's convenient, as the military is coming this way. Really? Says Lynn. What, what are the chances? <laughs> I'm going to question many things about you now. <laughs> uh, anyway, I can't, I can't uh, hand you any weapons here in the open uh, when you guys are ready. Find me at my place at the southern part of town. Okay, let's we'll go to the southern part of town and just walk into a house and be like, Give us a gun! And then um, get shot immediately by anybody, including him, maybe. Wait, you haven't told us, we haven't told you our names yet. I don't speak English, so I don't care. I probably couldn't pronounce it anyway. Oh, I haven't told us his name. It's Leonid. Leonid Kazimirovich. Kazimirovich. Hey, I think I got that one. Leonid Kazimirovich. Uh, well, I'll be going now. Remember to go and find me uh, so I can give you your weapons. You want a free gun? Come hang out with me, the guy who kind of looks like a hobo, and I'll give you a free gun. <laughs> anyway. All right, cool. So we're all in here now. All righty, I guess we'll talk to some more people, and then we'll end this episode before we go find that guy. So everyone's waiting for the ferry, but I doubt there will be enough boats for everyone. So really, there's just um, there's a lot of people to talk to here. Hmm. Let's, will you say we clear out this area? Oh, there's a cat for us to steal! And then we will, uh, we'll, we'll go save right there. So, these bastards, says Pessimistic Man. They can't get away with what they've done. Did, wait, did he say that earlier? He probably did. No, he didn't. He said stuff I couldn't read. Hmm. It's, uh, it's got some pretty intense yellow eyes. The yellower they are, the more evil or something. Are you a cat person, Rourke? Um, I prefer dogs. I have nothing wrong with cats. I'm definitely, I am fond of animals. I'm gonna go with dogs. I prefer dogs, but hey, cats are cool too. I like dogs. They seem fun. Oh, well, I guess he doesn't, he barely knows what a dog or a cat is. Yeah, me too. Hey, a cat has been found. <laughs> Hello, little thing that I'm going to save. I don't really like you. I like something else better. What? I thought you were going to save me. I'll save you anyway. Just get in my pocket. <laughs> Motivated young woman. I won't let them take our home. Will you help too? Did they give you a gun? Wait, why couldn't you give them out in the open? You're just telling everyone you're giving people guns. Who are you? Are you one of them? Of who? What do you, why would you assume that? I'm just walking around town. Um, oh, it's you. I'm glad you found someone to help you with Russian. Hey, that lady understood we didn't understand her. That's kind of amusing. Um, we won't make it. What's it? A uh, distrustful guy. Okay, cool. Uh, but I don't want to leave. This is my home. There's got to be something we can do to stop them. Unfortunately, no. Uh, we need to catch the next ferry. It's not safe to stay here. All right, cool. So we have now cleared out this area. Let's, uh, let's talk in here. Let's see if we can find the old lady. I've decided we're going to find old lady first, if she's here. I don't know. Hello, are you an old lady? You look like an old lady. Down hard, lady. She's a lady. So I'm saying lady a lot. I don't know what I'm doing here. I don't even believe in praying. Aw. Uh, my sister in, uh, st insisted that I should wait here uh, while she secures a couple of tickets for the ferry. But the lines are insane. Was there a line? Just a group of people. A big cluster there. On top of that, I had to wait for a friend, and my phone died. Do you think I could, uh, uh, you could take this note to my sister? Or you, can I use your phone? No, I fell in the river. So, I guess not. Um, I know we just met, but I don't have anyone else to ask. Please, why don't you just walk over there and tell her and then come back? I mean, sure. Well, we're messengers now. Don't worry about it. Sure, leave it to us. There you go. You should be able to find her at the port, and she's wearing a, she's wearing red pants. Cool. Sister's note has been added to your inventory. Neato. Oh, no, no, I wasn't trying to talk to you anymore. I was making that go away. Thank you. Hello, lady who had a crying child. Worried mother. Please, someone. I need help. Okay, that's, oh, that was it. They weren't going to say anything. What's wrong? M my son, he's sick. He needs medicine, and we just ran out. I can't go to the pharmacy uh, to get more, but because I can't leave him, and I, I don't even know if there will be, uh, if they'd be willing to help me right now. Well, I guess you could let us do it then. Would you uh, go and check for me, please? Uh, sure, absolutely. We're doing everyone's errands right now, anyway. Thank you so much. The drugstore is to the north near the port, uh, where everyone is waiting for the ferry. Good, that's where our other request is as well. Uh, the guy who works there is not very kind. But maybe you can turn him around and change his mind with these guns! And she throws guns at them and they go rob the place. The end. <laughs> I like that story instead. Uh, I'll be waiting for you here next to my boy. Thank you, and good luck. Also, I'm not going to tell you what kind of medicine he needs. 
f just to find medicine. F find some. Just throw it at the child. It'll work. Don't worry. It's how it works. Uh, sub. Mama, I'm so scared. Sub. Oh, that's it. Hello. How are you? Kind woman. I can be there with you if you need to. We'll get through this. I promise. And the guy, grieving man, I just found my brother is one of the first victims. I don't know how I'm going to tell him. Oh, that's sad. Oh, that actually is pretty sad. Hello. Oh, okay, we're activating a, a notable scene here. Okay, good day, Ivan Nikolevich. Niko, Nikolevich. Hello. <laughs> I can't speak that. Uh, you look troubled. Can I help you? Ah, uh, it's nothing. We're just looking for an old lady. For a second, I thought they said fat old lady. <laughs> looking for a fat old lady. Um, I was told she came here to make a donation or something like that. Don't You know the thing to help the poor and the, the people who are out of their homes? That, that thing, that, that the donation thing. Um, Charity Collector is his name. Oh, yes, she left moments ago. Of course she did. What? This town is like five buildings. How are we missing her? Uh, she wanted to know, donate some apples, but sadly, I couldn't accept them. Uh, we're only accepting or taking donations of non-perishable food. I mean, eat it? If people who are literally here right now could eat it. Hey. Um, uh, she still insisted, though. Uh, she ended up uh, giving apples to uh, every volunteer here. Hey, that works. That's cool. Good work, lady. Uh, you'll have uh, more luck looking for... Her at her own home near the river, she looked tired. So I guess she doesn't live with that other guy's family or whatever. Uh, with her son, that would be the person. Um, is that a place where we woke up? Wait. Are we just going back to where we were? Oh, oh no, we woke up on the, the river bank. Okay. Oh, I see. Thank you for your help. We stole her clothes. She's going to be like, wait a minute, those clothes are really familiar. They went missing. I don't know what you're talking about, lady. <laughs> don't mention it. Uh, good luck finding her. Okay, cool. Bye. She's totally going to be like, those clothes, you stole our clothes. <laughs> uh, she looked okay. We're going to go that way. As we talk to these last two people. Hello. She, okay, not talking to her. Hello. Uh, don't, okay, we're not talking to anybody. Hooray. <laughs> So, hey, I guess we are going to end this right about here because we have a save point, which I'm going to go ahead and save right about uh, there. So, hey, this has once again been more long gone days, and I have a bird on my head because why not? But, hey, I am still enjoying this quite a bit. Again, there's been no combat in this. This this RPG is very story heavy, um, but I still like it a lot. I like the art. I like the... The other kind of art is a pixel art and like hand-drawn stuff. Uh, the characters are enjoyable. I'm like, the plot is, it's actually interesting. I like, just got some cheese and stuff here and there. Um, and not even moldy cheese, like pretty good cheese. <laughs> it's got some cheesy like writing and like anime-esque stuff, but I'm okay with that. I think it's pretty cool and hopefully you guys do as well. So uh, hey, if you've enjoyed this episode, if you've been enjoying the series, please do let me know with a, a like, comment, sharing this with a friend or anything like that. So it genuinely does help out the channel way more than you guys realize. I know I say that a lot, but it's, it's true. I'm trying to get this channel back on track. I don't appreciate any help you guys would be willing to give. Um, but hey, for now, I hope you guys have enjoyed some more long gone days and a whole bunch of uh, cool character... Uh, character-based RPG nonsense that I enjoy quite a bit. But I hope you guys have enjoyed. Take care, and I will see you next time.